Hello everybody, my name is Perry Ankle and today I have another summer video for you guys. Basically I'm going to be showing you guys my summer accessories for 2018. This is three main groups and that is baseball caps because I love baseball caps for the summer. They just keep the sun out of your eyes or if you wear them backwards they give you a cute 90s vibe. I also have some bandanas, only have like three of them, but I still think they are super cute for the summer as like a headband. And the last group is sunglasses because of course you need sunglasses during the summer. So I just really wanted to show you guys these, maybe inspire some looks. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get right into the video. Okay, so I'll start with the smallest group, or semi-smallest group, I don't know, and that is bandanas. So bandanas I think are just such a cute headband to have during the summer. They add a really rustic vibe to any look. And I have three, um, so first one I have I just got from a leadership seminar. We were the pink team, so we got pink bandanas. This one is so cute. I think it would go well with a black outfit just to add a little drop of color. It would also good, go good with like a white shirt or a pink shirt. Other than that, I don't know where it could go, but it's super cute. I also think you could use this as a tie around your neck, but I really like this as a headband too. Next, I have the really basic red bandana. I got this from Walmart. <laughs> Walmart is seriously my life. Again, I mostly use this as a headband, especially with my favorite Ghostbusters shirt during the summer. It's a super cute outfit, especially with red lips. I really love it, and it's just the basic, you know, red bandana. Okay, the next bandana I have is like a maroon one kind of like it's like a more purplish pink than the first pink it is super cute it has a Patriots thing in here not because I like the NFL team I hate the NFL team but my school is called the Patriots and it also has a breast cancer sign because we wore these during volleyball season during breast cancer awareness month so that's where I got this it was specially made by my volleyball team's coach and yeah this is an eighth grade so it was a long time ago i don't play anymore but the color is super pretty and i just love the meaning behind it and again we used it as headbands but you can use it as any kind of wrap like around your ankle around your arm bandanas just add a more summery vibe next i'm gonna go into baseball caps baseball caps again just keep the sun out of your face and they're just really an essential i would say especially if you have a bad hair day i have multiple of these so <laughs> bear with me so the first one I have is actually says Winter Place on it. It was from my ski team, but it's my only black baseball cap. So I definitely want to wear this. It's very simple, very cute, and it's very easy to pull off. It's my most simple baseball cap, I guess you could say. And the black just really matches with a lot of outfits, even though it does have the logo. And even though it does say Winter Place, I still count it as like a summer item. <laughs> Next, I actually have an actual baseball cap. Um, I got this at a Pittsburgh Pirates game. It is gray, has the Pittsburgh Pirates logo, very feminine. And there's no adjustable strap on this one, so you kind of had to judge the right size. This one honestly looks good with so many outfits. I, we I wear it every time I go to Pittsburgh. It is so cute and so amazing for bad hair days and I don't know why it just ties so many outfits together even a really formal outfit you can put this on and it just dresses it down so well I really don't know how to describe it it's almost like a miracle hat next I got this one from Rue 21 on Black Friday that says bad hair day obviously it is jean print so super nice super cute um, I need to tighten it a little bit, but I feel like this would look good with like a white t-shirt and leggings. Just like this could be the statement piece, or it can be like a regular, you know, adding to a regular simple outfit. I feel like this would be an amazing staple piece, and if not, it would just go good with anything. Just the jean texture is really cute, and just the simple little monochromatic logo. Next, this hat was made for me by my friend. It has my monogram on it, I think that's what it's called. It has my initials on it in my favorite color. And then the hat is a really cute bubblegum pink. This is one that I would most likely wear like this, just because it is so girly. I feel like I could wear it around like have a 90s vibe since it is so girly. I feel like hats that aren't too girly, I can't wear like this because it makes me look very manly and masculine and that's just not the vibe I'm going for. If you're going for that, sure, you do, but this is just my own style. And I feel like this is really cute and would look really good with dangly earrings and some oversized hoodies, especially around bonfires. And again, perfect to wear on a bad hair day. This hat I got from FYE. I'm sure you all already know what it is. I've had this one for a while. It is my dipper hat. Gravity Falls is one of my favorite shows. So as you can see, I really love it. It has the pine tree on it. Same 
teal-ish color. I got makeup on the inside of it, but on the brim it has a Bill Cipher's little logo kind of thing going on. It is super cute. I plan on wearing this so much. I wore it for a Dipper cosplay last year. You guys saw in my Halloween, like, five easy costumes, I believe it was called. Super cute, and I really love how it looks. It looks exactly like the original one, and it's so, it just makes me so happy, and I feel like such a nerd. This thing is another jean print, but it's a dark jean print. I got this at Captiva Island in Florida at this restaurant called The Bubble Room. If you're ever near Captiva Island, please go. It is such an amazing restaurant. It has the Bubble Room logo on it. Very cute. <laughs> this logo probably doesn't make any sense. Well, you just have to go to like get the full experience. It's such a cute diner. And this jean hat can go if you're wearing like denim on denim, but you don't want to like two denim and out. I don't really like denim on denim, but if I'm wearing like a denim jacket and a denim like jeans, <laughs> then I can wear this and not feel like too, uh, but still feel kind of put together even though I'd probably never do that, but that is for you girls who like that kind of style. I'm here offering all sorts of advice, and it's just a really nice grayish texture, and I don't know, it's just really cute and super easy to adjust. Next, I have three pairs of sunglasses. I am starting with these ones that I got from Walmart. The ends are broken, but they are still super cute. They are this orange, peachy kind of cat eye look with some orange tinted frames. Super cute for a white outfit, just an added pop of color, super adorable, like this. I love them, <laughs> but the only thing is they aren't very wiry, so they're plastic, so they feel a little cheap, but I still like them. Next pair of glasses I got from Aeropostle for two bucks. They were having an ultimate sale, and it was pretty cute. Um, they are the normal gold frames, kind of look like Aussie glasses, but I think they are super cute. I love the tint. It's a little, it's not like, I think the tint is just kind of dark. It's just darkening it out. And they're just super cute, super simple, and such a good deal for $2. I would definitely recommend going to Aeropostle during the summer. I don't know if it's just me, but all the locations around me are having like 50% off sales and stuff like that. So I would recommend going there and checking out their glasses because you might find a steal and get something like this for two bucks. And the last pair of glasses I have, I got from Loft down in Florida. These are honestly the cutest glasses I've ever seen. They are like this. They are gray marble. They have gray marble frames metal of uh, like legs I guess you could say and then the gray marble is also back here super adorable it has like this little top bar thing also the bridge of the nose is there a lot of support right there awesome tint it is super cute these are just honestly so adorable I have wear worn these like 50 times and I'm not kidding and it, they're just so cute I never fail to get compliments on them and I feel like they're perfect for a day at the lake or on the beach wherever watery location you go I feel like these will definitely get some compliments anyway guys that was my summer accessory collection I hope you all enjoyed and get inspired Anyway, I guess I'll see you all. Anyway, I guess I'll see you all later. Bye.